coalition with folks all across this country, all across this country, has created a set of demands. It's interesting, and we're going to drown them out. We ain't worried about that. Because you know, when we call, they don't come that way. But when we call one another, we better come blazing and with our sirens and with all the things that we need to do to make sure we're safe. The media always says, whether it's Black Lives Matter or Africa Matters, do you have demands? And in both instances, of course we have demands. And our demands are not new. Our demands have been pushed forward by people in this community and abroad in an organized fashion for quite some time. We are not activists. Activism is a tactic. We are building community power. We are organizing ourselves and our community in an institution to fight against Babylon, y'all. Those five demands. Invest in housing, 10,000 units at the scale that's needed. In those 18 days, we've had meetings, three meetings with over 300 people and the consensus was Brother Africa should have never been on this street. And had he not been on this street, he would have not had to come face to face with the murderous police force. Amen. We want full scale housing now and we will fight for it. Amen. Continue to fight for it. Amen. We are saying end the occupation. Amen. Much like Palestine is occupied, Skid Row is occupied. Amen. Whenever you can't sit down, whenever you can't sleep, whenever you can't eat, whenever you can't say to your brother, yo, here go a dollar, without them being on your back, you are in occupied territory. We are saying end the occupation. In Palestine and Skid Row, end the occupation. End the Safer Cities Initiative because we don't feel none the safer. We say safer for who? We say can't kill Africa. Can't kill Africa. Can't kill Africa. Another demand if the media really wants to know, is to expand the SMART team. I don't know if y'all know, the LAPD has a world-renowned SMART team that they developed after they killed another sister living with mental illness in the early 90s, Margaret Mitchell. After the lawsuit, they were forced to create a program which is world-renowned called the SMART team. They go from city to city, from country to country, talking about this innovative model that pairs up the LAPD with a mental health specialist. And they're supposed to be in the community. Guess where they are stationed, y'all? They are stationed in Central Division. The entire division is stationed in Central Division. And they will not deploy the smart team, which feels more like a dumb team to me today, in our community. Had they simply listened to their radios, they could have walked from the station to this spot where we are right now and talk to Brother Africa. Instead, they, they go for lethal force instead of logical force, right? They go for lethal force instead of logical thoughts. We're saying today, right now, bring that smart team out here, get rid of the SEI initiative. We don't believe, number four, I don't know. We've been pushing back against the state for a long time. And they tell us, just wait. They tell us, just wait ten and a half months. The investigation will be good. Just wait. Just wait. In this moment, as we near the April 4th march, the words of King ring in my head in his letter from a Birmingham jail when he said, wait for the Negro means never. Wait for the Negro means never. And today we'll say, wait for all poor people and all poor people of color means never. When they say wait, they mean cool your heels. When they say wait, they mean walk away. When they say wait, they mean we hope you'll forget. We say wait means never. We say when the mayor comes out and justifies the actions of the, the, the killing of our brother, we can't wait. We say when Chief Beck on the one hand says wait, it'll be fair, and the next day says the actions were justified, we can't wait. When the, when the um, president of the police commission comes out, he's supposed to represent us, the civilian review board, comes out and says, wait, 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 we say we can't wait. Because wait means never. If we are waiting, 
we are waiting for them to legally, justifiably assassinate and lynch our brother. We say we won't wait. We say bring in an independent prosecutor. We say give us the power. We will take the power to hire and fire. We say down with the police state. Can I get it right on? Right on! We're saying the system is broken. And it is our duty, once we have identified that the system is broken, to do something about that. Amen. And then last, but not least, and this is for the media, and this is also for our community to understand our demands, it's to recognize and promote the community expertise and innovation that has always existed and that continues to model struggle efforts across this country from Skid Row. Our creative arts, our musical arts, our political acts, all of these things that we give to the world freely, we're saying you recognize that. I'm going to say this to y'all. There was a newspaper article. One of the demands that we had, Pastor Q and General Jeff, at one of the larger marches, went inside the mayor's office and demanded a meeting with the mayor's office and the Skid Row community. Three days later, the mayor held another meeting with other black folks, because for the mayor, any black folks will do, and we definitely don't want to engage with this community. We definitely don't want to engage with the resistance. Yes, yes. We are saying we are here. We are not going anywhere. Yes. You can go across the planet and find people that's not from Skid Row. Yes. Who's attempting to represent us? We will deal with them later. We will deal with you today. So our representation, TC, can you quit messing up? <laughs> TC, can you move your bike back? Because you represent in a whole nother way right now. I appreciate you, brother. We're saying, no way, no how. You can go find the, 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 the favorite black flavor of the month if you want to. We're not going anywhere. They can occupy the seats, but we're going to occupy the streets. Yeah.